I started bow hunting in 86. It's a neighbor of mine got me into it when I was a kid. That was Elko right there. I didn't shoot a bull till 96. It's elk hunting. It's when it's going to happen, it's going to happen. We're close. We're really close. See what the wind does. If it gets wrong, we'll just back off. They're all over up in there. I guarantee you a bull's going to come through this right here. We got to get further this way, though. We won't be able to see anything. Right. There's an elk right in front of us right here. That big bull's up on top. That's six. Spike Town, USA. There's a bull bedded on that ridge right there. Yeah. Thirty-five, I count. Thirty-five bulls. Thirty-five bulls. I think we should kind of just axe it out and do it and figure out what they're gonna do. That's been about 11 years since I killed a bull. It's a dry spell. Been been busy with the kids, so watching sports. And it's nice to be back out. I think they're right where we left them last night, right? Yeah. Try to get in there and set up on those wallows. That sounds like a good plan. I think if we get, if we keep the wind right. Yeah. As long as they don't switch on us. Get up in there and see what you think. Yeah, there's a ball. No, he's a big freaking six point. I'm gonna go go from that tree right there, see if we can pull him by.
right here, right over the hill. I couldn't get drawn. He was looking right at us. I could see. I thought he was going to come right here, and he was right here. He came quick. Yeah. Yeah, it was like... We're just about that. This ridge right in front of us, we just glass straight across. You can see them on the other side. They're pretty high in there already. That's that full moon I think we're dealing with, getting them up there that far before daylight. Right there. We being watched. Oh yeah, that full sees us. They're all watching us. If you think you get him back, two hours, man. You want to peek over her? I don't want to push him. Yeah, let's do it. I'm pretty sure I hit. Which way did he go? He turned and went just straight, straight over. over. But the hole, because it just went whoop. Broadside. Yeah. Yeah, he come and he turned this way. You see his horns is barely. I know, man. Even if I come this over enough. He's buried. Right there, you think these yeah, things would stick out? Even coming on this trail, oh, probably all would almost. We never could have, never could have glassed them nope. up from our angle. Who doggy? It's been a few years since I've been out bow hunting. Was, I think it was four or five since I've been bow hunting elk. It's been really nice to get back out and see what they do. Remember what they bugle and watch them chase and. I mean, you can get close with a rifle, but when they're in the rut, it's just different. It's a blast chasing them with a bow. 